cyclone Yas, is very likely to cross, North Odisha to West Bengal coasts, between Paradip and, Sagar Islands, close to the north of Damra, and south of Balasore, during noon of 26 May, as a very severe cyclonic storm. However, most parts of the state, mainly southern and, central parts, are likely to experience, light to moderate rainfall, since morning, that will intensify to heavy, to very heavy rainfall, by evening. Cyclonic storm, Yas, is very likely to, make landfall, with a speed of, 155 km per hour to 165 km per hour, gusting to, 185 km per hour. East Singham, West Singham, Sirakala, Kasor and, our likely experience, extreme rainfall, while Ranchi, Kunti and, Gumla, might see heavy too, very heavy rainfall. According to West Bengal Chief Minister, over 11.5 lakh people have been evacuated from vulnerable places in West Bengal on Tuesday in view of the impending cyclone Yas. Over 3 lakh people have been evacuated from the low-lying and vulnerable areas in Odisha. NDRF says, 99 teams committed, across four states 18 NDRF teams, have been deployed in, Odisha alone. State Disaster Management has directed districts to make alternative arrangements for electricity at hospitals and ensure oxygen backup. The State Electricity Department is also prepared to deal with any imminent damage caused by the cyclone. The department officials said they have distributed electricity poles and wires to all divisions so that power services can be restored at the earliest in case of any damage. Five apps and websites will help users track live status and location of storm. These include SRI India's Cyclone Yas Path GIS map application, Windy, IMD's Mawson website, RSMC website and 
Umang up. As many as 13 trains that depart or pass through Ranchi Railway Station have been cancelled. Bhuvaneshwar Airport in Odisha has shut operations from 11 p.m. on Tuesday, while Bengal's Kolkata Airport will close from 8.30 a.m. on Wednesday. Please like, comment, and share this video, and subscribe our channel. Press bell icon, to see updates on our latest videos.